Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today we are here again at Seacliff. Now, we were here about two weeks ago with Clark Fishing SA. We had a fantastic session. We had about 12 squid throughout the whole day. And he got about 15, so we did pretty good. But I've just looked around and look at this. Every man, I don't know if you can see that. Every man and their dog is on that water. Hey guys. Your up. We're gonna try our best to get a good session in and I'll see you guys on the water. Alright, so we're gonna start off heading into the shallows. A big up to the guy who came up to me and said he liked my videos. Really appreciate stuff like that. So yeah, if you ever see me, come up to me, say hi. Love that kind of stuff. Ah, so I've just passed another guy out here. He said he also watches my videos, which is awesome. So thank you very much for that. I know you're watching right now. So yeah, hopefully I can get a few for you. But yeah, he said there's been a few bag outs this morning around the pool. So that's awesome to hear. And we're gonna try and get one ourselves now. So the jig I'm gonna be using is the abalone pink belly from Mixed Jiggers. Unreal jig. It really cleans up in this area. And if it doesn't work, then we'll go straight to the red foil first cast. Guys, we have our first squid. Yes. Come on. First, about 15 minutes in. Doesn't feel too big. But, squid to squid, and we're happy with this. Oh, he's just on there. On by the tip of his tentacle. And look at that for a squid. Absolutely stoked. Everyone's down the pole catching nothing. Oh, no, I doubt they are. <laughs> I found my own spot and yeah, found a little squid too. So very happy, first squid of the day. And yeah, it's putting my nice rip and start. There he is, nice little squid, beautiful, beautiful colors. And that is a nice, very nice Southern Calamari. We've gone to a bit more of a deeper spot now, just so we're gonna drift back in and back over the spot that we just caught the squid. My brother's onto something here. Not sure what it is, it's no. It's a nice size snake. I thought I was snagged and I was just w w willing it in. I thought, oh, here we go. There's a squid on the end of my jig. Hardly put up a fight. It didn't pulse at all. I thought I, thought I didn't catch anything. Get him in. It's not a bad size one, actually. And there we go, nice calamari. Dude, <laughs> I just put my jig back in the water to handle the other squid and there's another one. Oh, this is a bigger one. This is a lot bigger one too. Yes. Oh, he's got some weight to him. First decent sized squid, this one. Oh, I get squirt every week, man. Look at that. Two in 30 seconds. Let's get him up. Oh. Now this guy is very aggressive, so I'm not gonna play with him too much, but there we go, another squid. That's two in about 30 seconds, so we'll try and get another. Just caught. They're both going together, so yeah, a bit of sight casting. Actually, I didn't see the second one. He kind of just took the jig when I put it back in the water. So once again, to humanely kill squid, all you want to do is karate chop them in between the heads there. So we'll give them a little chop. One and two, you see they've turned white. If the head doesn't turn white like this one has, you just give it a little one behind the head. And these two are completely cold out. And yeah, humanely killed. It has been three hours. And we are finally on to another squid. Oh, I was so close. I was nearly about to give up. The sun's fully up. I thought, yep, that's going to be enough for the session. And sure enough, we're on to another one. Get the net. Is that a follower? He's got a follower. So we'll get this guy in quickly. Oh. Yep, and we'll get that jig straight out there. Not sure where that other squid went. Oh, he's on it now. He's going for it again. There we go. <laughs> he's off. Time that drag a little bit. And there's another one right behind him. We'll quickly get this guy in. Oh, squirting. 
Oh, the other one got out. Oh, that was dumb. <laughs> well, we've got that one though. And his mate is still around. I know he is. Oh, we've just lost one. <laughs> oh, well, we've got plenty. We'll get his jig. Oh, my brother is on his first ever squid. Right under my kayak. Barely more. Here it is, his first ever squid it is. on the mixed Jig jiggers. Well. Abalone. My brother's onto another squid. Back on. That's his second. So it feels a little bit bigger. That's a better one. Definitely. Not too bad. I'm onto another squid here. Definitely not a bigger one. That was, oof, that was a massive squid of me. My brother's onto another squid here. All right, so we've already got about nine or ten and this guy's a bit small so what we're going to do is we're going to chuck him back in and do a bit of a water release let this little fella grow a bit all right guys thank you so much for watching this new video if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure you smash that like button make sure to subscribe if you want to we're going to be doing a lot more videos like this doing some catch and cook some solo camping we're going to do it all so if you want to see that make sure you subscribe we're so close to a thousand subscribers and that does mean we will be releasing merch so if you haven't joined yet now's the proper time it's a good time to join thank you guys so much so massive shout out to i think it was five people today who came up to me and just said hey saying you know they love my videos and saying keep going keep the good work up stuff like that you know that's what keeps me going it's just people how nice some people can be and just letting you know how good you're doing so thank you to everyone who did that you know who you are and you're probably watching this video right now yeah if you see me on the water again make sure you say hey if you're one of those people make sure you leave a comment down below let me know that'd be awesome and yeah we'll see you guys in the next video